Welcome to the Shooting Star Learning Center. For today's video, I'm going to be talking about dividing mixed fraction. So how do you actually divide a mixed fraction? The first step in dividing a mixed fraction, you want to convert to proper fraction. And I'll also be giving a clear understanding step-by-step -step mentor how to solve this problem. So please stay with me finish this video for full result and I'll also ask you to have a copy book with you in order to take note for full result and I'll also advise you to 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 focus avoid all distraction so the first step is to convert um, to improper fraction the second step is to switch to the modification and the third step is simplify and convert your answer back to a mixed fraction so how do we actually um, convert to an improper fraction by the way first we want to solve this problem so this is a, a fraction by itself this is a mixed fraction by itself and then this is a mixed fraction by itself so this mixed fraction, the whole section, the whole section is dividing by this section. So let us convert this to an improper fraction first, and then we can go to the next section. So here, how do we actually convert this to um, an improper fraction? We have 8, 2 over 5. So first if you want to do is to multiply the whole number by the numerator. I mean the denominator, sorry for that. You want to multiply the whole number by the denominator. How do you do that? Draw your divide by here. You got um eight times five. And put it in parentheses. Once you have done that. And then you add this 2 plus 2, which is the numerator. So we have, by the way, you still want to bring your denominator down, which is 5. 5. So here, we were, we're going to multiply 8 times 5. 8 times 5, and then add, add it by the numerator. You first multiply 8 and 5, which is the denominator, and then you add it by the numerator, which is 2. So, equal, we have 8 and 5, which is 40. 40 plus 2. And then, we get our denominator, which is 5. Which is 5. So, now, we have... We have we have forty plus two which give us forty two. Forty two over five. Now this is an improper fraction. How do I know that it's an improper fraction? An improper fraction is a fraction that the numerator is always greater than the denominator. Improper fraction, numerator is bigger than the denominator. So this is the first step, we convert it to an improper fraction. So next what we want to do is to solve this other problem. To solve this other mixed fraction. We have four whole number divided by two over seven. So how do we convert this to an improper fraction? You firstly apply the same steps, bring a problem down for whole number 2 over 7. Equal um, 4 times 7. 4 times 7 in parentheses plus numerator, which is 2. 
and then we still bring this denominator which is 7 down here so for 4 times 7 we give you 28 28 we have 28 28 plus 2 divide by 7 get our equal sign here Twenty-eight plus two, which will give us thirty. Thirty divided by seven. So now we have derived uh, an improper fraction because we said our first step in dividing mixed fraction is to convert to improper fraction. Now we have on both sides our improper fraction here we have improper fraction and here we have improper fraction so what's the next steps so we have our improper fraction here now we want to switch to 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 multiplication we want to switch to multiplication so how do we switch to multiplication by bringing our problem down the improper fraction that we have here which is 40 over 5 divide don't forget the divide sign right here divide by 30 over 7 so now once you have reached to this point you want to you want to use the keep change and flip method the keep change of the keep change and flip mentor the keep we're going to keep the first fraction on change we're going to change the sign to multiplication and then we find we do the reverse which will be um 7 over 30 keep 40 divide by 5 I'm um, sorry on the multiplication change the multiplication and then they'll do the reverse of 30 over 7 which will be 7 over 30 once you are doing the reverse of this it sign automatic automatically change from on division to multiplication So now, what you want to do is by multiplying the numerator by numerator, which is 40 times 7. 40 times 7. Oh, by the way, it's not, it's not 40. I made a mistake here. We go have um, 42. Divide by 40. This is supposed to be 42. Sorry for that. Then this is supposed to be 42. This be 42. So see the problem there? Once you are not paying full attention and then you miss one problem, the whole mathematical problem going to be wrong. So you want to be very cautious, take precaution and observe your calculation. I just observed my calculation and then I actually added in my mouth but I didn't write it to them. Which was 42 and now I get it 42. And 7 times 42 which will be which will be equal to 2 294. Two ninety four. So we want to multiply the two denominator, which is five times thirty. 
Trap time thirty will give us one fifty. Yes. Once we have reached this point, we ask ourselves which number we can divide by two ninety four and at the same time divide by one fifty and go it into both number evenly. We want to look for one number that go into both number evenly. So for this case, we'll use six. 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 We we'll use six. So we say six divided by six divided by um two ninety four. By the way, if you have calculator, you just plug it in, and then you again forty nine. Overall, six divided by one fifty, which will which will give you twenty five. 25 once you have reached this point you want to convert back to an improper fraction and how do you convert back to an improper fraction you want to ask yourself you want to ask yourself how many times 25 go into 49 how many times How many times 25 go into 40, 49? 25 go into 49 one time. One time. Um, one time 25 is 25. Uh, you have 49 minus 25, you get 24. 24. And then we just bring our 25 down here. So this is the answer that we've been looking for. So this is the answer that we've been looking for. So again, to convert back to to mix number 49, 49 divided by 25, which will give us um converting it to to to, to a mixed fraction. 25 go into 49 one times one times one times 25 is 25 25 minus you get you get 49 minus 25 will give you 24 and that's why we get it 24 up here as our name of reader and then we just bring our denominator down which is 25 you remain constant so thank you for watching Please share this video. Um, if you share this video, you are not only supporting me, but you are also helping your friends who find hard times um, solving this problem. And also subscribe to my channel if you have not. And I will see you in the next video.